It's great to see you back. I know you've been back a few weeks, a couple of months in terms of fitness and, and training and playing wise. How's it been? How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm feeling good. Um, like you said, it's been it's been it's been a while. I think over ten months now since I've sort of played first team. So yeah, it's been a while, but I've had a few months under my belt training now, so I'm feeling good. I'm ready to go. It's, it was a shame because you got over the hamstring, and then you had a little problem with your heel. Was that just a frustration instead of the setback for a week or two? Yeah, it's one of them. You look after the hamstring so much, then other things can sort of let you down. But yeah, you expect Nigel was coming back from such a long injury anyway. Just getting your body used to like the history of being back in training full time sort of thing so i did well in my rehab um and everything with that's gone well so yeah picked up that little foot thing but got over that quite quickly so um yeah i'm, I'm looking forward to being back out there yeah good stuff i know you've been in and around the first team in terms of training for quite a while then you had that game at Tranmere. how nice was that to be back on the pitch and, and effectively a first team game yeah that was nice obviously i played a few times for the b team now so it's just about getting the minutes up before i sort of went back into the first thing so i didn't want to sort of break down or put push anything too early um, learning from experience so yeah I've, I've just been taking my time but um, like I said playing against Tramo was nice playing in a first team game just being involved was was nice to be back around the lads again properly yeah yeah we don't know yet if you'll play against Leeds the manager suggested every chance that you'll be involved if, if you do play it again is that another important sort of stepping stone yeah of course I'm like I said I'm fit and available so where I get picked um, even if I play 10 minutes I'll, I'll give it my all as I always do so um, yeah I'm just looking forward to being involved again hopefully get some minutes again and just keep building up really yeah and just in terms of, of that competition specifically we know if we beat Leeds on Tuesday night we go through to the knockout stage which I think is important for everybody who wants to do that and, and, and play games and keep on a run yeah definitely we, we'd never go into a game wanting anything less than a win so we'll be looking to try and win tomorrow and try and progress in every competition that we can um, obviously get to the final so it's a game at Wembley, which is good, a great day for the club and the fans. So yeah, we'll be looking to definitely try and win tomorrow. And given the strength of the squad we've got and the, the number of bodies, I, I imagine it's more games than merrier in many ways because everybody wants to be involved and everybody. And this is another outlet, another competition for people to play in and, and stake their claim. Yeah, definitely. Um, we've got a, we've got a big squad here, but even when the gaffer changes it, the, the players coming in, the, the the level doesn't drop. So yeah, everyone will be ready to go tomorrow, and whoever's called upon will, I'm sure, put in a performance and um, hopefully we'll get through. Yeah. Yeah. Just Lastly, on the game, it's funny when you play 21 side, you never know quite what to expect. But Leeds went and scored five at Tranmere, so it, it's a proper game, you know. It's certainly one that nobody would be taken lightly. Yeah, I think Jefferson, I don't think they've been beaten this season, so they'll be they'll be coming here full of confidence, um, as we will be. And we want to try and get some goals and and go and attack and try and win the game. Um, but I'm sure it'll be a good game, yeah. I'm sure it will. Um, and, and just keep that home run going. I know Saturday was a bit frustrating, we didn't get a goal, but at home the side's been really good. And I know it's a different competition, but it's another tick in the box if we just, just keep building on that home form. Yeah, it's another game, like I said. And, um we're just gonna we're gonna do everything to attack from the from the off being being the home team, and um, regardless of competition and opposition, we're gonna focus on ourselves and uh, try and get the win. Yeah. Yeah, and I know for you the focus obviously is getting back into League One, and I'm sure you're not a million miles away. And so you're champing at the bit to get a chance, albeit the squad we've got, it's, it's not easy to get back in there, is it? Yeah, it's tough, but that's part and parcel of the game, really. Everyone needs to be ready just to be called on. You just like football changes all the time. You never know you could be needing next week out the squad the next. That's just how it is. Um, so yeah, everyone's everyone's around to go, and I'm I'm definitely looking forward to it. Hopefully, to get some minutes in at some point. Yeah, and we're only a dozen games in the season. We're still in October. It goes through to April. I, I know everybody wants to play now and attempt to get it, but it's such a long season that everybody's going to play. You would imagine some some role at some point. Yeah, and like it's sort of what we played if like nearly ten ten games or whatever now. So and also I haven't been involved yet. So for me, I'm just looking forward to to getting back out there and being involved and being around the lads. So yeah, it's one we're definitely looking forward to. Yeah, and, and just last year, I know you, at the minute. You've sort of been there as a support the front of better phrase backing the lads support the lads a little bit frustrating this one at the minute but is that all it is you know we're not a million miles away I think that's the feeling within the camp isn't it if the girls can start to, to click yeah definitely and like I don't think it's just the attackers like missing chances or anything it's just it's, it's a collective performance um, and uh, I think when we do sort of click I've, as you can see the build up like there's going to be goals and we are we are an attacking team and we, we will create chances and score goals so I think when we get a few I think we, we will go on another run and we can start that tomorrow